Hi guys, we're here at Camp John Hay, Baguio. This video is for those who are looking for an affordable Airbnb accommodation for big groups or like in our case, family of five. We've been to Baguio many times and we've always booked in the city proper where you're near public transportation, retail, restos. This time, it's, uh, it's different. We just want to breathe fresh air and to be away from the busy city. That's the business center. So our Airbnb host told us to drop by the business center before we could be allowed to enter the village. This is the entrance. It's basically like cabin in the woods. This is the registration area. You you will have to register the name of the guests, your vehicle for temporary sticker. Name, address, and contact number. First name pa naman kasama. Details po ng sasakyan, rental details, and signature. Okay. Hello guys! Perfect timing namin dito sa Baguio. The climate is super cold and the scent of the air is so fresh. Alam mo lang talaga na fresh siya. So this is the cabin where we'll be staying at. I'll give you a tour of the room in a bit. Ang paunahin ko mga sa ito. Dito kami magsistay for 3 days and 2 nights. 3 floors pala ito. Ayan sila. So, dito kami sa... Baba lang naman kami si ground floor. Pasok na tayo sa loob. As we turn left, dito na agad kami. And, pero meron pa rin paakyat para sa other red rooms. Doon kami. Dito na kami sa ground floor para hindi mahirapin yung iba namin kasama. Then, first thing sa common area is itong kitchen. Sa layout niya, mauna yung kitchen. Pwede kayo dito magluto. Kami mamaya magluto kami ng bulalo. Dahil malamig. In case you wanna store meat, veggies, you have a working refrigerator. Here are the other appliances. Then let's check na yung mga nasa loob ng cabinet, starting with the upper cabinet. Dito sa una, we have yung mga baso, spoon, fork, and tasa for coffee. There is enough for all of us. Mm -hmm. 
So, allowed naman to gamitin. Basta huhugasan after. Yun lang naman yung rules. May pitchel. May strainer. Yung winding plates. Kompleto na actually. Yung ulam na lang wala. May mga mangkok. And the other cabinet, my rice cooker. Here are the other utensils for cooking. Hindi ko alam yung tawag. And here, sa lower cabinet, you have yung mga pans. Okay, and yung mga tools for cooking. Sorry, I don't cook, so I don't know what it's called. Okay, close that. Then what else? Okay, on this side, yung uh, trash bin. So, kailangan nyo ilabas yung mga basura nyo after. So, you have here yung a functioning na cook top and range hood. And then, meron dito yung water dispenser. Open up. You open up. Hit you on, baby, yeah. So that's the overview of the unit and common areas. Let's now proceed to the bedrooms. By the way, this unit is a three bedroom with three toilet and bathroom. So, may free na pala dito na water. Ilalagay nyo na lang sa dispenser. And then, ito yung view sa window. Just by the dining area. Pero, di, di kami dito kakain tonight. Yun lang yung consequence niya. Kailangan kung doon kayo magsistay sa villa, dapat siguro may sasakyan kayo kasi medyo kong lalakarin about 10 to 15 minute walk. But if you have car, uh, mas madaling mag-go around the place and explore. So I'll show you yung mga stores na meron dito.
Sige, sige. 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 S